Micha chapter 6. Hear ye now what Yahweh saith. Arise, contend thou before the mountains, and let the hills hear thy voice. Hear, o ye mountains, Yahweh's controversy, and ye enduring foundations of the earth. For Yahweh hath a controversy with his people, and he will contend with Yisrael. O my people, what have I done to thee? And wherein have I wearied thee? Testify against me. For I brought thee up out of the land of Mizraim, and redeemed thee out of a house of slaves. And I sent before thee Moshe, Ahron, and Miriam. O my people, remember now what Balak, king of Moab, devised, and what Balaam, the son of Baor, answered him. Remember from Shittim to Gilgal, that ye may know the righteous acts of Yahweh. Wherewith shall I come before Yahweh? and bow myself before the high God. Shall I come before him with ascending offerings, with calves a year old? Will Yahweh be pleased with thousands of rams, or with myriads of waters, myriads of rivers of oil? Shall I give my firstborn for my transgression? the fruit of my body, for the sin of my soul? He hath showed thee, O man, what is good, and what doth Yahweh require of thee, but to do justly, and to love kindness, and to walk humbly with thy God. The voice of Yahweh crieth to the city, and the man of wisdom will see thy name. Hear ye the rod, and who hath appointed it? And there yet treasures of wickedness, are there yet treasures of wickedness in the house of the wicked? And the scant measure that is abominable? Shall I be pure with wicked balances? and with a bag of deceitful weights. For the rich men thereof are full of violence, and the inhabitants thereof have spoken lies, and their tongue is deceitful in their mouth. Therefore I, have, I also have smitten them with a grievous wound. I have made thee desolate, because of thy sins. Thou shalt eat, but not be satisfied, and thy humiliation shall be in the midst of thee, and thou shalt put away, but shalt not save, and that which thou savest will I give up to the sword. Thou shalt sow, but shalt not reap, Thou shalt tread the olives, but shalt not anoint thee with oil, and the vintage, but shalt not drink the wine. For the statutes of Omri are kept, and all the works of the house of Ahab, and ye walk in their counsels, that I may make thee a desolation, and the inhabitants thereof a hissing. And ye shall bear the reproach of my people.